thing. I'm kind of from the drag racing uh, world, you know, and uh, so the mongoose and the snake are back together. Mm -hmm. The true mongoose and snake are mm -hmm. together today, and uh, uh, I wanted maybe you could uh, tell the people a little bit about what all you have here other than just drag stuff. I kind of thought you had pistons and rods and uh, drag racing, but walking through here and seeing what you have available here it amazes me. Kind of tell us a little bit about the different things that you have. Certainly. Well, first of all, it's, I'm really glad that you came by today. Well, thanks for having me. So, okay. you know, I always like when people come and visit and kind of get an eyeful and kind of get a, an idea of what we're all about and what we make here. Well, they need to see it to appreciate it. I mean, I, yeah. if you're in anywhere near Southern California, Orange County area, I suggest that you give them a call over here and come by and take a little tour of this place because you'll be amazed. Uh, this is like going to places that are going to the moon. They're so far advanced on everything. Tell them a little bit about some of the stuff you have and what you do with it. Well, we do pistons and connecting rods. The rods are uh, steel and aluminum. Uh -huh. And of course the pistons are all forged. Uh, we make pistons for many different applications, primarily racing. We do uh, you know some restoration stuff as well, of course, and some high-performance street stuff. But primarily, it's for high-performance race engines. So we would do you know motorcycles, which would include you know street bikes, Harley Davidsons, you know supercross, off-road, um, sport compact market, you know really turbocharged four-cylinder and six-cylinder mm -hmm. engines. Uh, a lot of drag racing stuff, different classes, you know, pro stock, uh, top fuel, blown alcohol, all the stock and super stock classes. Yeah, I know you have the Pedagon yeah. brothers, yeah. Are, are a couple of the top name guys that run your stuff. I imagine there's a lot more than them. Yeah, we have some top fuel teams as well, uh, uh -huh. and uh, we uh, won the pro stock championship last year with Elite for pro stock cars and uh, any of the stock and super stock classes as well. I see that it looks like you're uh, you're kind of getting ready to rock and roll in the diesel business a little bit from what I yeah. saw the I saw the uh, the the uh, steel uh, the Carrillo uh, steel rods and then I saw you have a new uh, section out there that's very good but more inexpensive for the people that can't afford the other ones and I saw how it starts from just the bulk chunk to the finished piece and that you've got the diesel stuff coming up pretty quick now where people can so tell us a little about your yeah, diesel. Yeah, the business. diesel stuff's been real exciting. The rod's been available for a couple of years now and we've had great success with that. It's a steel rod and what's nice about the combination with the rod and piston is we can come up with combinations that normally you wouldn't be able to purchase anywhere else because we're making both components. Uh -huh. So we have a combination that we do uh, say for the Cummings where guys normally would put a spacer plate in the block to to, uh, to get a longer rod in there. What we do is we uh, we make the rod longer, and then we can also sleeve the wrist pin size down to uh, uh, for the uh, Duramax style piston. Uh -huh. But we put that in a Cummings piston and combine these combinations that that are sought after by racers, but really haven't you haven't been able to really purchase this combination of parts together before. So yeah, it lightens up the assembly. You know, we're going to a wrist pin that's about a quarter inch smaller in diameter, lengthening, lengthening the rod about 800 thousandths. Yeah, the weight, uh, I think uh, the weight uh, difference I saw from the standard to what you guys do is, that's going to make a yeah, big shortens difference. It, well, I got one right here actually. Shortens the piston up quite a bit from what's stock. Uh -huh. So it makes it a nice pack for the customer. 